And welcome back to Let's Play Dragon Quest Builders 2. I just realized I didn't clear out this area. But anyways, I did a bit of landscaping in between episodes, so we now have a ton of flat area to work with. It's also really gross looking, so one second. Oh, you know what? Actually, no, 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 no. Don't do that. I just realized I should probably be using, like, worm food, shouldn't I? To just, like, turn it all to grass. That would actually make a lot more sense than doing what I've been doing. One minute. Uh, what do I need to make worm food again? I need night soil. We don't have access to night soil yet. Okay, we'll worry about that later, though. Let's get all of my crops moved up, since, yeah, I kind of basically completely raised my entire field. That's fine. I have all the... Wait, hold on a second. Okay, yeah, I have all the seeds in my inventory. We're fine. So... Instead, let's start expanding our field here. Because, yeah, I'm basically going to turn this into a gigantic field. And then we're going to connect it to, like, a little platform where all of my housing and my bathhouse is going to be. So, how big do I want this? Actually, you know what? Hold on. How big do I want this to be? I think that might be good. Oh, actually, wait. How far can I go the other direction without, like, leaving the base area? So, we've got, what, four across? Two, three, four. We're still inside the base, right? Yeah, we're still inside the base, so that should be fine. So we'll go five out in each direction then. Alright, that should be good. So let's just make this one gigantic field, and then we're going to use the power of fences to basically make it one field so we don't have to worry about space or anything. Because, yeah, as long as you or was, as long as you surround it with fences, it will count as a single field, as we've seen before. The game did demonstrate that to us. So we're going to finally take advantage of that. Also, yeah, I kind of feel like we should maybe put some supports underneath this. Like, it looks nice when Erling like, kind of looks cool when it's floating, but at the same time, it's kind of just a giant floating platform. We kind of want to put at least some supports in, just for the aesthetic. But yeah, how far out do I want this to be, actually? Oh, at some point I need to also work, uh, move my workbenches up. Maybe we'll make like a little room for all my working. Oh, you know what? One other thing I should probably do. I should probably make myself... Uh, what is it? Some new weapons. Because we did unlock a new weapon type last time when we were in the swamp. I kind of haven't had the chance to build it yet, though. So we'll probably do that later. Also, as long as we're up here, I don't think we can get attacked by ghosts. Like, I think we're actually completely safe because they can't fly. I think. I might be wrong on that front. They might be able to fly and will come kill me. We'll see. Alright, so how... Mm, it kind of looks uneven. Let me see. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. One minute, I went out one too many. I was wondering why it looked uneven. Okay, we can expand the field later if we need to. Also, let me see here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Wait, hold on a second. No, yeah, 14. Duh. So I kind of want to go 14 out. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 2 more. How's it going down there, by the way? You guys okay? They're fine. Yeah, I need to get them some better weapons. I think right now they're still fighting with their basic equipment. I'll make them some swords, and, or like what that new sword we unlocked in the morning. Alright, there we go. So we have our gigantic field now. Something tells me I'm going to have to expand this at some point. Okay, so now we're moving into the housing area. And because of that, that's not what I wanted. I'm actually going to be using floorboards from here on out. So I'm going to make like a little path out to a little, or not a little, but like a big platform. That should be good. And yeah, we're basically going to make our little dormitory over here. We're going to make the dorms and the bathhouse. Actually, how far out can I go? Hmm. Oh, actually, how much room do I need for this? Uh, it's going to take quite a bit of room, actually. Okay, I need more floorboards. You guys okay down? Oh. Uh. <laughs> huh? 
Come on, you. Can I carry more than one person? No, I can't carry more than one person. Let's get you to bed. Oh, you know what? No, no, no. This might work better. There you go. Like, a good, like, nice shower is usually really refreshing, right? Like, that's usually how people recover, I think. I know medical things. All right, now, Roth, you're coming with me. Come on, let's get you in the shower, too. You're probably all sweaty from all that fighting last night. All right, they'll be fine. Honestly, I was maybe considering the idea of an underwater farm, but I think that would take way too much work. I'm still trying to figure out what I want to do for the next chapter. The next chapter is kind of restrictive from what I remember. Eh, I'll make it up as I go. Okay, so let me see here. Fields are good. <laughs> Please don't sleep in the water. Anyways, what was I doing again? Right, I got distracted by the whole unconscious bodies thing. But I want more floorboards. Not that many. Actually, maybe that many. No, not that many. Let's get 20. I think we might have to go gather some wood soon. Also, I need some more soft wood as well. Because I need that for the bathhouse. Okay. And yeah, I want to make an outdoor staircase at some point so I don't have to keep going down there every single time. Also, while I'm here... Let's start actually making this. Hmm. You know, maybe I should have made it a little bit bigger. Actually, no, I think this is a funny room. Never mind. Okay, no, you know what? No, we're fine. Also, I want to get some gates, too. So that I don't... Uh, what is it? So I can close off the ends. Oh, you know what? I just realized it's going to result in, like, a border of purple soil. Eh, we'll replace it with normal soil later. Okay, so let's put down a fence here. And I only have one fence. One minute. And a fence on this side. Uh, what else do I need to build right now? Is that it? Yeah, I'll worry about the bathhouse stuff later. Okay. We have an enormous room here, and now it's an enormous field. So have at it, guys. Oh, I do need to get them a water source, huh? Hmm. Wait. Idea. Is this gonna work, actually? One second. Here, I'm actually gonna put this over here. But I have an idea of where they could get water. What if we make, like, a little watering hole in the very center? Would that work? I don't know. Only one way to find out. Also, let's make sure this is centered. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven. Wait, hold on. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm going to put that to mark it. Because I think we could probably do like a 4x4 or a 2x2? Or 4x2. Four 4x2. Two? Four two. Four two. But yeah, if we make like a little watering hole here, would that work? One second, I can't see. Uh, let's get some soil down. Actually, maybe we should put some wood here instead. Oh, right, there's a hole in the ground, so people are going to be falling through for a little while. That's fine. One second. I can't build the Oh, I know why. I'm out of room. Yeah, the game is a little bit weird when it comes to, like, where you, you have to be standing still in order to build. Okay, there we go. Every time I see that worm butt. Also, yeah, while I'm here, I'm gonna put some fencing around here just for the looks. Just because I'm kind of tired of people jumping off the building. We'll put the rest down later. But yeah, if I put this, if I put this with water, will I be able to use it to water the crops? Also, yeah, you know what? Maybe I should have used wood instead of dirt. Actually, you know what? No, I think this is fine. It's going to be covered anyways. 
Now we just need to be careful. Okay. So let's see if they can use that to water my crops. Speaking of my crops, I should replant all my crops. So what do we got here? Cabbages and where's my wheat? Uh, oh, wait, it's right there. Okay, let's get these planted. I guess we'll take these three rows for cabbages. And I'll put wheat on the other side. Then we'll plant whatever else we have later. Alright, moment of truth. Can you guys use this as a watering hole? Please say yes. Wait, hold on. I think they can. They're getting water from somewhere. Oh, are they walking all the... No, I don't think... Are they walking all the way to the other water source to get water? I think they might be. Darn. Hmm. Okay, so that won't work. Oh, I'm kind of sad. I was kind of hoping they could use this water pool instead. But no, I think it has to come from the water block. Okay. Let me think here. Darn. Okay, you know what? That's fine. But you'll figure something out later. Man. Now I'm sad. Thanks, guys. You disappointed me. Well, I'll leave the pool there anyways, just in case. Anyways, I want to get these in the ground for now, though, just to make it a bit faster. Oh, wait, can't they? No, I don't think they can start planting yet, can they? Well, whatever, I'll do it myself. Hmm. So we might have to design some way to irrigate this area instead. What if... What if we could route water to, like, little outcropping, like a little watering hole that connects to all the fields? Well, no, the main problem with that is we can't build in the center, because of that stupid tree. You know, for such a holy tree, they're not very easy to build around. They take up so much space. Oh, well. Hmm. Alright, we'll figure it out later, though. It's not that far of a walk, fortunately. Alright, so let's get that bathhouse built soon. Uh, let's continue building our platform over here, though. Because, yeah, this is going to be a big platform that's going to hold both the dormitories and the bathhouse. We'll continue using what we have for the dormitories for now, but yeah, I want to build the bathhouse at least. So let's at least get the platform built out, because I think I'm going to have the bathhouse over here and then the dorms in the corner over there. And yeah, I need to figure out what I want to do for roofing. Wait, hold on. Am I still in the base? I'm in the base here. Okay. Oh my, oh god, oh god. So the AI does not know what I'm doing, that's fine. Okay, so this is literally the edge of the base. Okay, so we can't build any further out from there. Otherwise, it'll be considered outside the base and won't count. So we have a hard border now, that's fine. We'll make this like the back wall or something. Hmm, that doesn't leave us a ton of room then. I might go another layer in. Or maybe I'll just not make a huge gap between uh, the fields and the dorms. In fact, we don't really need a gap at all, do we? Oh, I'm dying. You ever get so engrossed in something that you forget that you're starving to death? It's fine. We're good now. Alright, so how much room do I need for this bathhouse? Let me see. So if I put it here... I want the back wall... Okay, yeah, you know what. We don't really need a gap between the fields and the dorms. Okay. So if I put it right here... How would that look? Maybe one more to the left. Hmm. Actually, let me put it a bit over here. Alright, did that work? That's still... Yeah, that is still technically in bounds. Alright, perfect. So we're going to build a bathhouse here. What do I need for this? Uh, I have the hard... Or sorry, not the hardwood. The uh, floorboards already. Oh. 
So let's get this bathhouse built. And yeah, I'm definitely gonna put some supports up. Actually, speaking of supports, I do have the logs I need for supports. We'll put those down later. All right, so how far? Okay, one more layer of hard or floorboards, and then everything after this is softwood. Yeah, I'll figure out like roofing and stuff later. The game is not designed around roofs. I'm gonna be completely honest with you guys. The camera does not know how to handle roofs half the time. Drapery door, ceramic sconce. I do have sconces, don't I? I have one sconce. I need to make another sconce. I need to make one of these. I need to make a pot. Wait, don't I have a pot? No, I don't. Uh, simple stool. What else do I need? I need four wash tubs. Okay, yeah, we're definitely going to need to get some more wood later. I'll go out and just cut down a bunch of trees. One more sconce. We have one in our inventory already. Uh, let's see. One of these. Is that everything we need? I think that's everything we need to build. Okay. I guess I can put that away for now. Let's get out... Oh, you know what? This might... Hold on, I have an idea. I'll, I might do it in between episodes just to try something out, but let's take this out. Oh, you know what? Hold on. I should probably keep planting. One second, let me plant the rest of my seeds first. Also, we might need a... Oh! Nice! Uh, we'll do that in a second, actually. But yeah, I might need some more field room, actually, looking at it. We might have to make a second massive field. I didn't realize I had that many crops, but I guess I do. Okay. But yeah, I have an idea of what I could do with these horizontal logs, but like I said, I'll worry about that later. For now, though, let's go ring the bell. Everyone on the farm is super- oh wait, I actually have to ring it. As in push A and not just hit it, uh, hit it with a hammer. But I'm going to be honest, I am actually kind of liking how this farm is turning out so far. And we got some newcomers too. And we just learned a bunch of new recipes. Oh, perfect. Okay, we can actually make use of a lot of these. Oh yeah, bench. Also, are those really called buntings? I didn't know that. Ooh, perfect. I really wish I had done this before I planted all my seeds already. Yeah, I didn't realize those are called bunting. But yeah, farm is developing really well. But yeah, now we can just basically tell them what we want to plant. We're not going to make use of that right now, though. Maybe later once we get a ton more seeds. Yep. Oh god, why does everyone want to report us to, uh... The freaking authorities? Listen, technically what we're doing is illegal, but it's really nice looking. I need to fix that. Also, yeah, I think I am going to get rid of that little pit. It looks terrible from the bottom. But yep, more farmers. We have so much help now. It's great. Okay, but here's what I'm thinking. Let's, uh... Oh, game, you can get rid of that uh, tutorial now. I know what I'm doing. Anyways, let's get these planted. And by planted, I mean put down. One second. Oh, wait, is this too far? No, this is perfect. Never mind. We're good. I wish we could fly. It would make building a lot easier, that's for sure. It's one too far. Darn it. Oh, wait, I'm outside the base. I just realized the music changed. 
Yeah, you can always tell when you're outside the base if the music changed and Malroth and the dog are following you. Instead of just wandering around the farm on their own. It's gonna be really weird next chapter when I have to call this air my base something other than a farm. Also, how did that end up under me? It's fine, though. Uh, one more up. But yeah, I think we have everything we need for the bathhouse at least, so I'll get that built, like, right away. That looks a lot better. Let's put one over here, too. This one will be a lot easier to build because it's a lot shorter, I think. Wait, hold on. It's here, right? Yeah, it's right here. One second. One more. There. And then one on this corner. Actually, no. Maybe I'll, I'll hold off on doing this corner for now. Because I have an idea of what I can do here. For now, though, let's get back upstairs. And yeah, I need to build a staircase somewhere that'll let me up faster. Like, maybe a good grand staircase. Or not grand staircase, but like some kind of way up. Wait. Water elevator. We're not doing a water elevator. Water elevators suck. Okay. Alright, go ahead and till those, uh, that soil. So what am I missing here? I need... Okay. I need you... I need you. And I think that's it. Wait, is there no... Oh, wait, no, sconces, duh. I was gonna say, is there no light source in here? Alright, so sconces go here. Oh, I need... Uh, what is it? I need those bags for the walls, right? What are they called again? Oh, I need a towel rack, rack... Or, sorry. Towel, rail, and cloth sacks. Wait, do I know how to make those? Hold on. I don't want to get one of these, but no, uh, oh, wait. I don't think I know how to, oh, wait, no, here they are, never mind. I just didn't scroll down far enough. We're good. And then I want one of these. Oh, yeah, since we just leveled up, I think we just learned how to make them. Where is, oh, right, I need to put the windows down, too. Where is my... There it is. Okay, that should be everything we need now. Let's see. Put a pot here. Let me see. What do we got here? We need a wash tub here, 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 and here. What else do we need? We need a sconce. Oh, we need a wooden stool here. Oh, I need one more sconce. I, th I thought we only needed two. I guess that makes sense. I was wondering why it was telling me to make one more. It's because I need one more. Okay, we'll put some towel racks up here. Put the wash tub over here. And then I think we put this here. There we go. We got ourselves a bathhouse now. So now all of our farmers can come bathe. But you know what? Probably a really good thing. There you go, people. I made you guys a bathhouse. Come celebrate with me. Yeah, I definitely need... Okay, yeah, I definitely need to make us some kind of staircase. I'll figure it out later. You know what? I won't peep on you, but it's probably a good thing that you're taking a bath every day from now on. If no one here has bathed for the last month or so, everyone probably stinks like hell. But yeah, we have a bathhouse now. Nice. What I learned? I learned how to make a bath. <laughs> you know what? Sure. One second. That reminds me, I do need to make new weapons. What do I need for this? Bram oh, I need brambles. Okay, I'm gonna go gather some brambles later. Also, what do you want? Do you want me to level up? I already leveled up. 
Yeah, I already leveled up, bon uh, Bonanzo. <laughs> yeah, I got this one just after I leveled up. Nice. Please don't betray me. Great. We have converted more people to building. Also, I just realized that pillar isn't connected to anything. Hmm. What are you saying? Great. Someone's already seizing power. This is all about farming, guys. We don't need politics here. And for once, Malroth is the voice of reason. You know what? Go for it. I'm okay if you prove yourself as the uh, true leader of the farm. Also, does a farm need a mayor? I guess it's turned more into a small town at this point. It's like one of those mega farms that houses an entire population of people. Also, what's going on? be great. <laughs> Perry, you really need to eat something other than cabbages. Pretty sure you would get malnutrition if you ate nothing but cabbages. Alright, but the dye tree is growing pretty well now. We're on our, what, third stage of growth? Also, I didn't realize just how many people live here now. Oh my god. Alright, before we wrap things up, though, what do you... That was an unusual animation for talking, but whatever. Oh, you want a toilet. Great. Oh, wait, no, no, you want a toilet. Ooh, that's actually really good. Because with a toilet, we can get night soil, which is the old term for poop. Okay, so we're going to make them a toilet. And what do you want? I like how the eight-year-old is the one boring her. Oh, okay, we just learned how to make bread. Actually, I think we could have done this a long time ago. Alright, we'll make her some bread later, though. And yeah, I'll get rid of that outcropping at some point. But first things first, before I forget. Oh, wait, no, it's not... Wait, no, it is connected. Never mind, there was just something in the way. Okay, we're good. Anyways, we'll make her some bread in a second. So, toilet, though. Do we want to... I guess we should put, put it, like, near the bedrooms. And the bathhouse. We'll make it maybe connected to the bathhouse. Actually, you know what? Yeah, let's, like, make... Uh, let's see here. Yeah, let's go a little bit out here, and then we'll make the, uh... What is it? The toilet over here. In fact... Actually, you know what? No, we're going to do this next time. I'm not going to continue building right now. But yeah, I have an idea. Also, I don't think we need to go out this far. Just looking at it. I'm actually going to break these up a little bit. Just to leave like, a little gap here. And yeah, I have an idea of what I can do with these logs. It's going to really determine how good it looks, though. I'll do it in between episodes. Just to do a little bit of experimentation. But yeah, we'll worry about that next time. So, next time on Let's Play Dragon Quest Builders 2, we're going to do some cooking and some pooping. Not in that order, though. So, till then. Also, yeah, I need more beds. I just straight up need more beds. We have five beds for like a population of, what, 14 at this point? Yeah, let's stop making everyone sleep on the floor. I have not slept for like three days, by the way. Actually, no, I don't think I've slept in like a week in this game. We kind of stopped sleeping after a while and just kind of built through the night. Probably not very good for us. Oh, well. So, till then... Oh, there's a ghost trying to kill me. That's fine. 